Temple OS, an open source 64 bit operating system designed to be the third temple prophesized by the Bible. It was created in 2005 by Terry Davis, an exceptionally talented programmer diagnosed with schizophrenia. He wrote the entire operating system himself at his parents' house in Las Vegas, which included a bootloader, kernel, window manager, 3D graphics library, and multiple games, all powered by his own compiler and custom programming language called Holy C. Amazingly, it all fits in under 100,000 lines of code at 1.4 megabytes, just as God intended. He believed he was God's chosen programmer and implemented features described as a modern day way of speaking in tongues. It renders graphics at 640 by 480 resolution, limited to only 16 colors. The underlying language, Holy C, resembles C or C++, but has functions that can be invoked without parentheses or arguments, and uses just-in-time compilation, which means it doubles as a shell language that can be executed directly from the terminal. Unlike other operating systems like Linux or Windows, it's ring zero only, which means everything happens directly in the kernel, including user programs. You have complete control over the operating system source code and hardware. That may not seem very safe, but it's the way it is because it's fun. To get started, you'll first want to download the ISO file from the Temple OS website. From there, use a tool like VirtualBox configured for a 64-bit operating system that boots this file. On startup, it creates a single immortal task named Adam. It's the father of every other task, just like in the book of Genesis. It can also take advantage of multiple CPU cores, where each core gets its own immortal Seth task. Once inside, you can take the tour or immediately start speaking in tongues by hitting F7, which generates a pseudo-random word from God. You can also have God draw you a picture with Shift F6 to perform a God doodle. That was fun, but now use Control M to open up the personal menu. From here, you'll find a huge variety of games, like 3D first-person shooters, 2D strategy games, and simulations like After Egypt where you play the role of Moses, and also has utilities to manage your finances and make music. Remember, this is all made possible by a custom graphics library. If you're not happy with the way it works, simply open up the source code, make some modifications in Holy C, reboot, and enjoy. Every line of code is right at your fingertips thanks to the Red C file system. The end result is one of the most complex pieces of software ever written by a solo developer. But there's a lot more to this story, and sadly, Terry Davis passed away in 2018 at the age of 48. He was both a highly controversial internet personality and genius programmer. This has been Temple OS in 100 seconds. Hit the like button if you want to see more weird videos like this. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.